Hey you guys, it's Joyce and welcome to another episode of Scenes by Joy. So today is day five of Vlogmas. Your girl made it to day five, okay? So what we're gonna get into today, you guys are going to do a self-care day with me. And along with the self-care, you guys are going to run errands with me. Now, the whole point of me making this video about self-care is because I have a lot of errands to run today. It's just one of those days where it sucks being an adult. Like, I have to get an oil change, I have to go pick up packages, I have to get a car wash, I have to stop by AutoZone. And days where I feel like I'm super, super busy like that, I always make it a point to make time for Joyce, make time for me, do things that I truly want to do. That way I don't feel like my entire day was dedicated to just running errands, being responsible, things of that such. So to kick this thing off, as you can see, got, got my what? So, I got strangers, guys. So as you can see, got my waist trainer on, hair tied up. We about to go to the gym. I have a hit class schedule at LA Fitness for 9.30. It's like 920 right now, but once again, it's right up the street from me, so I'm just gonna rush there so I'm not late for class. Well, at least not super late. But I'm going to hit up the gym because I really was supposed to be going to the gym super hard during the month of November and also a part of October, but life just got in the way. Life literally just got in the way. So now I'm really focused and dedicated on setting a schedule. Because I I want to, you know women, like once we get a little bit older, it's like it's hard to get rid of this up in her. I need to, I really need to stop eating red meat. That's really what my main issue is. I need to stop eating red meat. And I also need to stop drinking sodas. I had stopped drinking sodas, but then I started back drinking sodas. And yada, yada, yada. And it's not even good for my body. It don't even make me feel good after I get done drinking a soda or eating something that I know that I don't have no business eating. But also, I'm going out the country. It's gonna be bikini wear. You already know, with the little string, like, ah, bah, bah. So your girl is trying to look good. Your girl is trying to look real good. So I'm about to get serious about this diet regimen, this working out regimen. And even after trip, I just wanna maintain it because when you look good, you feel good, honey. So we about to go to the gym and hit it hard. All I have enough time to grab is my water, my banana, and like I told y'all, I'm on these things real bad. I don't think I told y'all. Did I say I'm on these real bad? I might not have told y'all, but if I didn't, let me tell y'all now, I'm on these real bad. Like, I'm addicted to Celsius. And what's crazy, the wild part, I like all the flavors, like all the flavors. <laughs> So I'm gonna go to that down, eat my banana, and then we're about to head to LA Fitness so we can work out before we get our day started. Oh, and what I forgot to mention, what I forgot to mention, on top of me working out, part of my self-care day, we're probably gonna get like an $8 protein drink because it's always a little treat for me. And then after I get my little $8 protein drink, I'll just run my errands in the midst while I sip that. And then we're gonna come home and do our full skincare routine. Because I've always, <clears throat> I've always struggled with, you know, my skin freaking out during the winter time. So now that I'm older, I try to get, ooh, something is in my eye. So now that I'm older, I try to get ahead of the acne outbreaks by staying consistent with doing a skincare routine. I still be having like little blemishes here and there, but it's way much better than what it used to be. So stay tuned for that and we gotta go. We gotta go. So. Okay guys, so we have made it to LA Fitness. I had to put a shirt on. It's cold outside. Texas, Texas fall winter weather is so bipolar like it was hot yesterday now it's nippy today i just can't get jiggy with it so we just put a little little nike shirt on but anywho we have made it to la fitness i'm about one minute late to class but it's all good but we about to check in go ahead and get this workout in i'm not gonna bring my camera in the gym i don't bring my purse or my camera in the gym so maybe i can record on my phone a little bit to show y'all what we doing but it get intense 
I'm probably gonna be real tired, but I will keep y'all updated after the workout about how it went. You guys, that hit class was intense. If you are looking for a gym, I'm telling y'all, LA Fitness is the place to go. You get unlimited workout classes, you get unlimited hit classes, and it's about $90 a month. I wanted a personal trainer, but these personal trainers be taxing. So the classes are pretty like intimate. There's not like an overcrowd of people there. Like they offer a lot of good things. So it's definitely worth the money. Cause baby, when I say those trainers in there be working me out, they be working me out. So we have our smoothie from Smoothie King. What I got today was the Metabolism Booster Strawberry Pineapple. And it's busting for the show. So what we about to do now, we about to go to take five to get an oil change and hopefully they can put some air in my tire because your girl been riding around on 27 air pressure on the tire for like two weeks now and that's a no-go. I need to put some air in my tire before I have a flat and that's gonna be a no-go. So we're gonna get the oil change, we're gonna get air in our tire. I need to run by AutoZone because my key fob, the battery is low. And then after that, I'm gonna wash my car and then I gotta pick up some packages. So yeah, and then once we do all that, we're gonna go to the house and we're gonna get this skincare, you know, relax, day popping because your girl is well out. And after I do all these errands, I'm gonna be even more wore out. So yeah, follow along as I do all that stuff and until we get to the house, so we can get to the calm and relaxing portion of this video. show you all my skincare routine now like I said my skin usually flourishes during the summertime and it breaks out heavily during the winter time so I'm going to show you all my like summertime regimen but I am looking to try out some new products for the winter although I love these products don't get me wrong I do like to give and dab really see what's out there and then I really would love to have a summer skin regimen and a winter skin regimen. So I'm going to show you all what I use all throughout the summer up until now. And yeah. So first things first, I'm gonna go ahead and get my facial steamer going. There we go. And let me get the excess water off of it. All right, you guys. So. This is the steamer that I use. It is Pure Puree Daily Care. I got it off of Amazon, so that is the steamer I use. And before I go ahead and steam my face, I'm just going to take some Witch Hazel. Get it from any local store. I use it as a toner. And I'm going to just take some paper towel. If you don't use paper towel to each its own, that's what I use. Or cotton balls, so I don't add cotton balls. And I just clean my entire face. Like, I just get all the excess dirt or makeup, all that stuff off. Because when you see your face, you're opening your pores. So you don't want to open your pores and allow dirt to go deeper into your pores. So you want to make sure that your face is pre-clean with the toner before you do all that. Oh, uh, I like to get in the cracks of my nose and up here in that little area. And before I recorded, like when I got home, I didn't first do this. I had to do my hair because I got work tomorrow and I wanted my hair to already be done. I have tape ends and i'm natural so yeah and i've been showing out i've been real sorry steaming so we're gonna steam it out before i do my facial cleanse 
but um yeah if you're a natural girl and you get tapings it can be accomplished it will last but you have to do extra maintenance and extra care so for example like i've been showing out i've been taking showers with just my bonnet on you know working out not really tying my hair down like i should and the thing is is that when you have type ins and you have natural hair you really really need to um take care of it like you have to make sure that you tie your hair down when you're in the shower because you know your hair will put foot and the thing is what i was taught is that if you tie your hair down and you sweat in your head do not take your silk wrap off until your hair completely dries if you take it off before then then it's gonna poop up so like i said you guys i have not been taking care of them i've been getting lazy this is literally i got my first install in october was it october no it was like the first week of november that's when i got my first install and then i got a maintenance and i was gonna keep them until january but honestly i get tired of hairstyles fast so yeah i get tired of hairstyles fast so i'm probably gonna get my beautician to take these out and do something different for the holidays because i'm getting braids the beginning of january because like i told y'all i'm going out the country on a trip which i will be vlogging that so you guys will see where i'm going and all that good stuff so right now oof, you get hot so right now what i'm doing i'm just getting moisture on my face opening up my pores and i'm going to go over it with this cleanse so i want to kind of open it up because if y'all can see that i don't know if it's focusing but it is first a beauty fab pure skin face cleanser it removes surface oils makeup dirt and impurities and it's safe for sensitive skin and my skin is a little bit sensitive and i've been having this since I think like the first week of June, like these products can be a little pricey, but it was worth it, they laugh. And then I just rubbed that all over my face for a deep cleanse. I will reach in the sink and get my hands a little bit wet. So it will lather, but really I just wanted, yeah, I want to do this. All that good stuff. Right there, go in with my forehead. Get a little bit more water on my hands. Hell yeah, get it all up in here. And then at this point, I let it stay on here. And then I just go back over with my steamer. Because I want that clean for me to get all up in there. But yes. Okay, guys, so I had just steamed the facial wash on my face and I went to the sink to really get up in there. And I patted my face just a little bit, but I wanted to stay wet. I wanted to keep moisture on it and I'm just gonna steam over it again. Okay, so I'm gonna let that sit on the side. So the next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take these facial Radiance pads, they help exfoliate, tone, and brighten. And this is by First Aid Beauty Fab 2. Let me back that up since you can't see that. So I have pretty much all their products. So while my face is still, you know, wet, I'm still steaming, I really want my pores to be open. So while I'm using like these cleaning products, it's really getting up in there. Oh, I just go. Like on my cheekbone or right there, my side, because I do wear my hair down most of the time. I go with my loop. And you know when you wear weave and your hair down, that causes acne. And I am very prone to acne. I struggle with acne as a kid. I struggle with acne as an adult. It's just one of those things that, you know, I have acne, but I try to maintain. I learned how to get older. I'm not really a makeup girl either. Like I put on foundation and like setting powder. I put on some mascara and all that. 
And when I'm trying to be real fancy, I'll do my brows, but makeup ain't never just been a thing for me. I was raised by my grandma, you know, them old heads, they don't believe in all that. I couldn't wear makeup until I was like in high school. And by that time, I was like, well, I'm already late to the game. I don't even care. All right. And I do like to, I have natural dark lips. And I do try to, I am trying to brighten them a little bit. Cause I wear lipstick, a lot of lip gloss, and it doesn't help the residue. So I go over my lips real good. And then after I do that step, I'm gonna go in again and steam just a little bit more. Just a little bit more. And then I'm going to take my Tree Hut Sugar Lips. Let me see what I focus in my Tree Hut Sugar Lips. And I'm going to exfoliate my lips. Because you guys, your lip skincare is just as important as your face skincare, okay? They go hand in hand. You need both. Can't be cute and your lips crusty. And I know mine get real crusty during the winter time, so I gotta really get up in there. Alright. Don't take much. You just kinda rub it. Get my paper towel in. I just take the excess off like that. And I like to keep my face moisturized. I mean, well not moisturized, but I like to keep my face moist, I guess. So I go back and forth. Really, you can just sit in front of this for like 15, 20 minutes, but I'm like a little kid, I can't do that. So, I'll just go back and forth with it and keep my face moisturized. So the next thing we're gonna do, we're going to, um, Put on this Collagen Hydrogel Gold Mask. I really just grab a random mask. <laughs> if I think the packaging is cute, then I'm copying. I got so many masks, I got foot masks, I got tummy masks, foot masks, like any mask you can think of, I probably have it. And this one looks scary, you guys. This one looks scary. I'm gonna put this part on my top half. Just go slick that down. I look like Zorro. Do y'all remember that movie, Zorro? Put that down like that. And then the second piece. on for a little bit because I do like at least do five ten minutes with this on in steam and then I'll be right back you guys to finish off my skincare routine okay guys so I had stopped recording because when I have that little mask on I like to get up in there with my steamer all that good stuff so I wanted to focus I wanted to focus so after I do that part I just take the mask off and I do not wipe off any of the leftover residue you just let that kind of seal your face go into your pores let it seep in yes and then the next thing I do I take this ultra repair firming collagen cream yes that right there same brand first A beauty fab and I got all of these things from ultra so, I just put some in my T-zone. And then I just work it in. And a little goes a long way, like I told y'all. And you wanna get that neck. You see that, you wanna get that neck. You wanna get up under there. Cause you know, that tells your age, that neck. And you gotta do this stuff while you're young, ladies. So when you're older, you know, we can age like fine wine. Cause I wanna be somebody fine mom, somebody fine green. All that good stuff. So I gotta take care of ourselves now. Okay, so I got all that in. And what I'll do next, I'll take the Ultra Repair 
oops, sorry, wrong thing. I take the hydrating eye cream with hyal hyaluronic acid. Hyalur Y'all yeah, can't say that word. It is what it is. Y'all know what I'm talking about. The hyaluronic acid. It's not focusing. But this is the tube that it comes in, you guys. It's eye cream. And what the lady told me, she was like, you don't rub it, you just pat it in. You just pat it in and go around the circle over it. And whatever's left over in your finger, you can like put, you know, on the top of your lip, bottom of your little corners. You just pat it, and it smells good, you guys. It smells like fresh cucumbers. So I just pat that in. And all that good. Okay, and our final step. Well, it's not our final step. I knew something else, but I go up in here. And honestly, I'll probably do this a little bit more after I finish filming. But if I just showed y'all how long I really go in with this, y'all be like, girl, cut this video off. Why are you, God, oh, why are you showing us all of this? I just want y'all kids to gif, but I really go in with this when it's just. And I take this little port and I go around my eye, both that in in the corners, all that good stuff. And y'all, the devil, my camera trying to die. So that's another reason I'm trying to show y'all the basics because honey, if this camera go dead, then y'all don't tell y'all going to bed after this, we ain't gonna finish. I just do more of that later. But get y'all one of these, get y'all a roller because this works good. And then put some oil on it like, I just kind of leave a little bit of the cream. I don't put it in as heavy because I want some to be left over to really rub in with this. And then my final step is the Ultra Repair Lip Therapy. By the same brand. I don't know why I won't focus, there we go. And you know, one of time, you guys, y'all don't want to be dry, so I need a healthy amount of that. It's probably all over my lips. I'm looking in my mirror too, my big mirror really get that in so yeah you guys you guys done and went with me to run errands we done went to the gym today we done got packages we done went to the car to, to the car wash we done went to a rest we done did all that today and we have done the skin care regimen so as always like comment and subscribe like comment and subscribe I'm about to close out this vlog because my camera is literally about to die. And plus, your girl is tired. I gotta go to work in the morning. So, until next time, bye.